Hey, it's Mom. Miguel. I just found out Charity could be waking up soon. I'm going over to the hospital. No, don't go there. Why don't you want me to go over to the hospital? Well, it's just that the hospital's on the other side of town. I mean, why go all the way over there if you don't even know if she's going to wake up? But it sounds like she might. Well, who said that? Jessica. She's at the hospital now. Well, how does she know? I mean, she's not a nurse. She talked to one. The nurse said it's possible Charity could wake up any time. But it could be a while, too. Uh, yeah, but I don't want to think about that. I know. It's too depressing. But what if you go all the way over there and Charity's condition hasn't changed? You'll be even more depressed. It's better to wait. I appreciate your concern, Kay. You're a pal. But I have to be there. I mean, just in case Charity wakes up, I'm hoping this time she'll recognize me. See ya. Yeah, I remember once she told me flowers were her favorite. You have a good memory. I remember everything we talked about, everything we did together. I mean, I just hope... What? Well, I just hope the next time she wakes up, she remembers me. I mean, I have so much I want to say to her. So many plans I have for us. Well, whatever happens, you know that I'll be there for you. Thanks, Kay. You're terrific. So are you. Ah, Grace is our beautiful daughter. And Miguel. Tabitha, what are you doing here? Visiting Charity. Has she woken up yet? No. She moves around now and then, though, but that's about it. Well, I'm going to get some tea. Anybody want a cup? No, thanks. <sighs> I've got to get Charity alone. So no one knows when she's going to wake up? No. How awful. Uh, Kay, I need to talk to you. Out in the hall? I think she's waking up. I'll tell the nurse. Uh, tell her to call Dr. Russell. How am I going to get to her now? She's waking up. Charity, I'm right here. Charity, it's me, Miguel. Do you recognize me? Charity, it's me, Miguel.